emotions and um, things about relationships with young people in this case. And just um, connecting in a way so that other people can see the story that they're interested in when they look at our work. I would just like to thank April and Elaine for putting together this amazing exhibit. Um, you know, it's one thing to get the thumbnail images on your computer and look at them and try to figure out what moves you to write a poem. And then it's a whole other experience to come into an art gallery and, and really feel the energy of the paintings because I believe any piece of art carries the energy of the artist who created it. And this gallery is certainly filled with a lot of beautiful energy. So thank you everyone for, for being here tonight. I wrote to this painting. Um, it really moved me. It, uh, it kind of speaks to me about the whole immigrant situation in the United States. And I was, I was very moved and wanted to try and capture maybe some of the thoughts that were going on with this family. Time at the bus stop. I had a vision that if we came here, we'd find a new kind of fortune. But who feeds guests with scraps from cans instead of platters heavy with fruit? My grandson places his hand on my knee and pleads, Where is my bed? I don't want to sleep on this hard step again. But steps are all I can see. One step for food. The next step, maybe someone will smile. Mm -hmm.